Well, no matter your summer plans, a tasty wine makes everything better. They say just add wine for a better day, right? Trends expert Justine Santaniello is joining us to share what her summer wine guide is for this season and how wine will be the must have addition to any party. Justine, what do you have? Let's face it, whether you're relaxing in the backyard, dining al fresco, or hosting a get together this season, having the right wine is key. So I put together a summer wine guide for you guys to make it easy. The next time you're picking out wine, you wanna look for a few things. I truly believe that high quality wine is a direct result of the care of the vineyard where it's grown. And that's why Etude Winery has always been a favorite of mine. You really can't go wrong with any of their high quality wines. In fact, for over 40 years, Etude Winery has operated with sustainability at the forefront, and it's remained committed to their role as stewards of the land by protecting their local ecosystems and supporting their local community through their employee garden. Probably my favorite part is that the winery has a goal to be 100% renewable electricity by 2024 and net zero emissions by 2030. Now for those summer barbecues, I like to serve Etude's 2020 Carneros Pinot Noir. It's sourced from Etude's Grace Benoit Ranch Estate in the coolest microclimate of the Carneros region, which spans Napa and Sonoma. This wine also shows why Etude is known as a leading maker of Pinot Noir, which by the way, just so happens to be one of the most difficult grapes to grow. It pairs perfectly with a juicy burger off the grill or a stuffed portobello mushroom. It's bright and lively with notes of red cherry, pink peppercorn, and pomegranate, and it finishes long and supple with spiced clove and minerality. And you can't talk about summer wines without a light white option, right? The Etude 2021 Pinot Gris is just that wine. It's refreshing with a nice combination of floral and tropical notes. There are hints of guava, kiwi, and lemon. Plus it's delicate and creamy. I like its long and dry finish. Now I suggest pairing it with dishes like curry chicken skewers, a jalapeno garlic butter shrimp, even a stone fruit salad. Now, if you're planning a trip to wine country anytime soon, definitely make sure to add a two to your itinerary and check out their variety of tasting options. And for more info, you guys can check out etudewines.com.